Hello YouTube, I am Mistis, and this is Let's Play Heavily Modded Skyrim. I will be using a plethora of mods, ranging from mundane things like left-handed rings and spending dragon souls for perks, to DLC-sized adventures, namely Moonpath to Elsewhere, which I will be going through blind, using a fun style of playing with help from the Midas Magic Evolved, Way of the Monk, and Spell Sneak Attack mods. I will also be using the Enhanced Towns and Villages mod, the Civil War Recurring Sieges mod, or the CWRS mod, and as you can clearly see, the alternate start mod to assure that this Khajiit will lead an interesting life. Alright, now that I've talked your ear off, let's play heavily modded Skyrim. Finish your name your character? Yes. Alright. Let's go with Mistis. Cause, you know, I'm Mistis. By the light of the moon, find the caravan. Tra oh, okay. That's the the elsewhere thing. Live another life. Hold on. So Approach, my this is and choose the, where your new life shall begin. This is the uh, live another life mod or alternate life. Um, where basically, instead of having to go through that gigantic, um, uh, intro, you can just pick a different kind of background and get put in that area, and, um, you can, uh, basically roleplay what you want from there. So, I'm thinking that we, hmm... We are going to be. Oh no! Yeah, I want it. We're going to escape this cell. All right, let's do this. I'm out of lockpicks. I'm out of lockpicks. Oh no, what do I do? Oh no, what do I do? I need to find lockpicks. What am I gonna do without lockpicks? Oh, lockpick, lockpick, lockpick. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay. I know how to lockpick. Oh, okay, so let's do this. Boom! Here we go. Alright. Now I wonder where I'm going. Oh, a woodcutter's axe. I don't need that. Abandoned prison key. I'll take that. Coin purse. I'm gonna take that. Okay. Skeleton. Poor thing. Whoa. No. Mortal fool. I am. No one hides from the dead. I am not hiding from the dead. I am running from the dead. Uh. Oh. I fear this may be. Ah. Uh. Oh, oh God. Okay. I made a wrong turn, but I think I'm moving towards an exit of some sort. Oh. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Oh no, my stamina's low. I'm out of shape. Whew! I think we made it. I, th I think I made it. Uh, it was close though. Really close. I wonder if they're following me out here. Abandoned prison discovered. Are they gonna follow me? No, they're not gonna follow me. All right. Oof. That was that was scary. All right. So I was left in an abandoned prison for the crime of I don't know. I don't know. I was wrongfully imprisoned. Yeah, that's much better.
Who is this gentleman? I'm on a pilgrimage to the Shrine of Azura, the Goddess of Twilight, if you'll excuse me. Where is this shrine? In the mountains to the northeast. I'll mark it on your map. Oh, how convenient. Thank you. Alright. Ah, it's raining. I hate the rain. The rain is sucky. And severely reduces my frame rate. Uh, okay, so... Now, do I want to dive straight into By the Light of the Moon? Or... Do I want to go exploring the magic mod? Or... Hmm, actually, I know what I want to do first. I want to get the, the unarmed damage mod. The unarmed damage thing. Uh, that is... I believe... Oops. That is, I believe, near Riften. So, the fast thing, the closest thing I can fast travel to is over here. Um, normally when I play, I typically try not to fast travel too much, but I think sometimes for the, uh, the sake of making these videos not forever long, I'm going to just fast travel a little bit. Um, so these are the Dragon Souls, where you can, uh, spend, uh, the Dragon Stones, where you can spend Dragon Souls for perks. And you can get mage perks, warrior perks, and thief perks, yeah. Okay, but... Uh, da -da. Ah, the thing I am wanting to get is over this way. And it is near the warrior stones. This game is so just visually pleasing. I, ah, this is, uh, if you'll forgive me, this is my first time getting to play this on an HD screen. Ah, and it's just lovely. I recently made the switch over to PC gaming and I must say it is much better. Ah, like the sounds are better, the, 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 the video is better, and even it runs so much smoother. There's nowhere near as much lag. Oof. That's brutal. <laughs> Poor thing. Alright. Now the thing I'm looking for should be around here. There it is. You see those rocks up there? Them's the rocks I want. No, that's Ember Shard Mine, so I don't want to go up there. But... Maybe if I climb up this mountain a little bit? Oh, there's a path. Oh, it just follows the path. Okay. Well... Here's the path! The Pillars of the Way, I'm sorry. There's a chest. I'm going to loot this chest perk requirements. These are all the different uh, special things you can get with the uh, unarmored, the, the monk upgrade, or mod upgrade. Pfft. So yeah, I will be taking this so I can get that. This is the books of the, the theology of the path of the way. And these are the hooded robes of the way, which I will immediately be donning. Because they are badass. Bam. I'll keep the foot wraps on. And the silver ring. Why not? So that way when I punch people in the face, it'll hurt. Alright. So... This looks like it's going to be rather fun. I hate the rain, though. Oh, wait. I forgot to activate the Pillar of the Way. Nice. So this is basically giving you one hand, uh, a weapon in your inventory that will be um, 
for uh, what the heck is it called? That will grind your unarmed skill, which they don't actually have a skill in the sky for. So what you do to do that is you just go to that. And since I'm planning on using magic and punching people, <laughs> it sounds. Ah, I I got the one-handed one because there's a one-handed one and a two-handed one. I should probably go over here. Oh, oh. I'm really bad about that. Most of the time when I play Skyrim, I attempt to, like, walk in obnoxiously straight lines and, like, horrifyingly avoid paths. I hope that's not annoying to anyone. Alright, so based on what we're going to be doing, we're going to be needing the Thief Stone. Whoa, what's this thing? Pillar of Aptitude? Learn Monk Skills 20% faster. You know what? I'm going to activate... Activate this path. Oh, The music kind of climaxed right when I chose the path. All right, so that's sneaking, punching, and and unarmored. That's cool. All right, so I think I'm gonna go clear dungeon. Ember shard mine is close by. That's a good first dungeon. I, I think that's why they put it near the beginning of the game. And I missed now the mine. Oh, okay. Nice. Hello. <laughs> Yes, I will destroy you. Oh my god, I'm sorry. That looked horrifying. I promise you it won't be as bad for anyone else inside. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna try to do this all sneaky-like. Yeah, so basically, what this character is going to be, to be is a sneaky monk that will use illusion magic on you. I'm actually going to steal this torch because it's always nice to have a torch on you. I'll get this one too. Now, I'm debating whether the using the monk skills makes me would make this character, you know, not want to just steal everything the way I normally do when I play this game. But, ah, uh, I don't know. It's just so much fun to just, you know, steal everything you come across. I don't know. Oh. They thought, crap, they found me. I'm terrible at sneaking. Ah! Ah! Ouch. Ah! You, you called me a rug as I bash your face into the ground. That's not very... Ugh. Ooh, a steel mace. How much is this steel mace worth? Not enough. It's too heavy. Uh, do you have any gold on you? Yes, you do. Ooh, and I'm earning it. Uh, I think that may be worth it. Do I want to start mining for iron? No. I don't. Okay. Sneaking through Ember Shard Mine. Okay. I am sorry if I sing horribly and a lot during this. I will try. Oh crap, not to. Well, no promises. Because I sing a lot. Oh. Okay, well. That might have actually been to my advantage. Huh? Shh, 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 shh. I don't want them to find me. Come on, go away. Go away, go away. Forget about me. I was never here. Don't worry about it. Shh. Go back to sleep. Come on. What's taking these guys so long? Yeah, there's nothing here. There's just uh, no one. Yeah, okay. So, let's try and s sneak up on them. What was that? Is someone there? Hurrah! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. So, I need to start getting good at, at, at healing magic. 
Because if I'm just going to be punching people in the face without wearing armor, I think I need to be good at healing myself. Okay. Yes, this is a logical train of thought. Okay. Mm, I don't want any of that stuff. Mm, I don't want any of that stuff either. Alright. So, sneaking through this cave is a total disaster. Has been a total disaster so far. I've been sneak attacked one person. Hold on a second. I am going to... Get my favorite sorted out really quick. Clairvoyance, that's a spell tome. That's useful for selling. Is there a person in there? No, there isn't. I think there's a person around here, though. Ah, uh, yeah, that went well again. Oh, Khajiit! Oh, God! Oh, God! Oh, uh, hey, my own arm went up to 11. Oh, actually, I may be able, be able to take that one off their hands. Okay. Cabbage, cabbage. Ugh. Here, what's in this chest? Leather boots. Yeah, I guess I can sell those. Ooh, I can sell that. All right. I, I, I am determined to get at least one sneak attack in this entire dungeon. At least one. I will be horrifyingly ashamed of myself if I can't do that. Okay, this person. Right down there. I'll just... Drop down. Oh, they didn't hear me. That's fantastic. All right. So, I'm going to pickpocket. Nice. So no. Ah, oh, crap. They found me. She found me. Oh, yeah, she found me. Ah, uh, please don't hurt me. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. I'm running away. Ah. Uh, I hate how you can't sneak in this game like you can in Far Cry 3. Ah. Uh, either that or she was just really good at spotting me. Alright, I guess I have to go out and hunt and hunt this person down and punch them to death. You didn't find me, I came to you. You're gonna rip me open? Yeah, you died. And the people dying in this high of a definition is kind of creepy. Because it looks kind of weirdly... Duh. Real. Not like real, but like... More realistic than I'm used to seeing in video games. Ooh, another chest. Okay, and gold. I like the gold. All right, let's venture on. Aha! Making it dark everywhere I go. Now there should be a not just an iron ore vein out here, but chest. Ah! I picked the lock. I wish, don't like, if picking locks was that easy, I would be thoroughly upset. Like, if I ever bought a lock, I'd be like, what the heck? I can get through this lock in like two seconds. That's, that's not a worthy investment. Uh, Alright. These things have never gotten me caught. I've never even seen them really appropriately placed in a place that would get me caught. But here is the end of the dungeon. Alrighty. So, I think that will be it for my first episode. 
If you liked the episode, hit the like button. If you wish to see more videos like this, subscribe. And comment below if there's anything specific you want to see, like achievements or any specific DLCs you want me to try. I'll, I'll be willing to look at anything, and I'll read every single comment. Alright, thank you for watching.